About two years ago, ESA, together with the Science Museum, decided to uh, run a new project to inspire a new student community about space and what space can mean for us in our daily life. And we invited uh, fashion schools in Europe based on the same nationality as our new ESA astronauts. Not only should the students be inspired by their missions, but we also challenge them to use variable technology. Reflecting material to help search and rescue team, absorbent material that could help you remove excessive moisture, or tracking device, and this is, for instance, athletes that would like to help improve their performance and see how they are performing in their movements. With technology, when you incorporate it into a design, you don't really know how it's going to look until you run the batteries and you see how it expresses itself. Questioning and looking into what technology might become in the future and is what, what was for them a big challenge, but at the same time something I think designers have to do more and more in regards to technology. A lot of us are technical, we also look at you know, problem solving, things like that. To come here and see how the materials have been used, the sort of the technology they've integrated, but also just the design as well. Some of the designs are so you know, novel and unique. So at this point, we have been able to visit five different schools and be presented to their design and their concept. And we have the opportunity to present 30 different garments at the Science Museum. And it's super exciting because what they have shown us is mind-blowing. <laughs>